I believe in teaching them so much that they want to leave, but they're loyal and they stay. I brought in a new accountant back in 2003, 2002, helped her go through, she already had her um, bachelor's, helped her go through her master's, went to a lot of classes together and stuff like that. She says, where can I go? I says, you can become a township manager. Let's get you trained in how to do that. But she wasn't going to be able to do that here. So I, I said, at some point, you have to leave. Oh. If, if you want to go higher, you have to leave. Mm -hmm. It was real tough for her. Um, but she left. She's now the CFO of the city of Dearborn. Wow. So she's bang, bang, bang. We've stayed in touch all that time. I continue to mentor her. Mm -hmm. uh, so here's the CFO of a city of 200,000 plus, comes back and helps me. And one of our other accounts who did the same thing, came back to help and bail us out of a bad situation. Extreme loyalty. And they wouldn't have come back if they hadn't been treated well. I think it's the coolest thing in the world that I am responsible for 17,776 votes of our citizens to elect public offices. I'm responsible, my name goes on that bottom line to make sure their vote counts. That's the coolest thing. That's the really coolest thing. I never thought it would be that cool, but it really is. It's a lot of work, but it's really cool. I see public service as just that. It's public service. You're not going to get rich, um, but you can be rewarded in many, many, many different ways. And teaching the reward factor to the different generations has to be done differently. But I think all of them can realize it.